Hey everybody, welcome back to Change Special. Um, we last left off, we just met Perel. And now we're going to... First off, I'm going to see if this is even recording correctly. I want to make sure the view is right. Okay. Um, we're going to... I think we're going to... Uh, that direction that the, uh... <clears throat> The tail went. I have my mouse on the screen again. Hello. I was worried, so I followed. You, you still don't like it? Okay. And also, be sure to stay safe. I will wait for you in the library. Oh fuck, what the hell? actually let you go. The failed sample is still disappointing, as always. He set up so many, so much help in so many tubs, countless times making trouble in my arrangement. Do you really think he did so much just to meet you? What a ridiculous idea. Of course, all he did was in order to assimilate you. I let you reach the library just to use him to assimilate you. I thought he would ambush you, but he just let you go. What's in his gooey head? My original plan failed, one after another. But what I still have is to stop you. Now letting you go it is to save you, but also to save everyone. You can't understand my goal and intentions. I did it to keep you alive. Just stay here and don't move. I knew I shouldn't have gotten a laser sight. But it doesn't matter if you see it. I still have confidence to hit you. After the riots, there were many guns left in the Institute. And I also had time to practice shooting. This gun is filled with special injections. Just one shot. The dose of the medicine inside is enough to make you a beast. Come on. It won't hurt. Just have it hit your head. I'm not even moving, I'm not doing anything. Don't mess around. I can't even hit your head, it's in my sight. Medicine 
in the shot only works when it hits you in the head. That being the case, as long as you can't hide. If you are caught by his laser, he will shoot. You know that you will be hit in this way. Don't run away. Look here. You succeeded at the moment. The laser scanned you. You took a big step and the bullet shattered the glass and hit the, a magazine behind you. I'm a little angry. Do you know how much energy it takes to make such a bullet? I only have four shots in total. I hope you won't make me waste any more. Keep doing this until he runs out. Okay. Oh, I forgot how to lock. Beastalization is complete. Listen to my voice now. Think about who you are. Accept it. Accept new you. Accept this feeling. You should follow orders, puppy. Resistance is futile. Medicine. The medicinal effect is just for you. Hey, what's going on? You are so good now. That's right. Wait, so did it like kind of work? Huh. Oh, I see what I gotta do. So like when he goes to shoot, I gotta move. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, don't tell me he's gonna make me watch all this dialogue each time. What the fuck? Oh, well, I mean, I did it once, so I do got the idea at least. Oh, that's how you skip that. I wish I had known that earlier. What the fuck? 
I do get it, but I don't get it also. Hell yeah. I admit that my shooting ability is not high. I am a doctor, not a sniper. The recoil of these shots almost desolate my arm. You're lucky I have nothing to do to you now. I also fully understand how you broke through these obstacles, those obstacles. You are a really flexible hidden da danger, but I will not give up. Next time I will find a more efficient way to animalize you. I hope you remember that everything need not to be so complicated. I have... I also have something I have to protect. Your pride? Actually, I just locked you in there. In here. Isn't it done once and for all with this now? Trapping you with, will only let everything go to the worst result. Is my ult ultimate goal to make you beast. Something's opened. Now go. There are many, still many rubber beasts that are still waiting for you. Automatic lock of the glass corridor has been unlocked. Eh? Oh no. You see, you can see from a distance a passage in front of you is completely blocked. No wonder that Blake Blake test be said, wait for you to come back. You really have to go back? Right. Yep, I remember this. Let me just, uh... Oops. Does the dripping one do anything different, by the way? Nice. down apparently. I want to see if the drifting one does anything different. <laughs> oh. I'll see if this does a different scene change. Actually, accidental.
think that one's the same. What the fuck? It just follows you, there's no way to get past that. You see that, right? It, it follows you down. <laughs> if you walk towards it, it just... Oh, I really want to see what the drifting one does, though. You know what, actually, I probably still can. Oh, what the? That's not fair. That ain't fair. I'm sorry, that ain't fair. Do anything new then? No. Okay. No, oh, hey, I am gonna do though. I'm gonna let him catch me here. This is probably a, a different double scene, right? Maybe not, maybe... Maybe, maybe not... Maybe not. Still curious about the drippy goo, if that's anything different. Go. I went, but I didn't mean to go there. Yeah, that uh, quick um, skip there makes things a lot easier. What? 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 I didn't do that before. The fuck? Which one was it that it did it? I don't remember. <gasps> Stay away! It was this one. Oh my god. Go, go, go.
was it? Oh. I was gonna see what the goo dripped in. No! Oh, you asshole. Did I scare you hidden danger? You panicked expression just now, it's so funny. I'm gonna have to run, ain't I? You should s s move on, hidden danger. Don't worry. I won't do this in the future, because it will hit you later. What will really make you a beast? I hope you're ready for it. You're quite shocked, but fortunately, you are still safe. The exit library is completely impassable. You can only go to the black latex beast called, calling himself Pro again. Perhaps you could trust him. Yes, please save. I think he's still after me, the thing is. Yeah. Or not. Oh. Oh no, how unfortunate. Is that it? That's it. <laughs> okay. Get off me, you heathen! You are struggling desperately, crawling out of the clothes. Clothes like creature. And the creature escapes. How long have I been recording? I've had the game window over the recording time for a while now. Okay, we still got time. So that thing doesn't actually come back to follow me. This is not the safe station. I just have a bad feeling it is. I didn't mean to do that. I could just do it there, but... Actually, I'll do it after I get up here and save. Just to see if there is any difference. Not. It's just a different looking one, I guess. Yeah. Sweep, toot, sweep. have to clean this place before the human comes back to make a good impression on him. And was startled by the human again. And the human is really quiet when walking.
Is that passage blocked? Even though it was a wasted journey, as long as human come back can come back safely is just fine. Anyway, there are only a few slow moving white latex beasts. I know that an excellent human being like you must just be fine. Eh, you ran into trouble. Eh, you almost couldn't come back. Eh, the situation was that serious? Human. I... Sorry. Really very sorry, I hid something from you. I just wanted to gain your trust and prove that I am harmless. Actually, I already know that the passage was blocked. But even if I had told you, you probably wouldn't believe the latex piece, right? So I decided to let you go and see for yourself, and at the same time, I would secretly follow you in to protect your safety. I was thinking when human finds that path blocked, to jump out and save you. Take you on the right path. The book says that if one does this, it can help get rid of alertness and help you trust and rely on me. But human doesn't seem to like being followed, so I came back here to clean the library. I thought that passage was absolutely safe. I wanted to tell you other routes once you came back, but then guide and guide you out of this library. I wanted to prove that I I really want to help you, prove that I am really different from those rubber beasts. I didn't expect this to have such serious consequences. Really. Sorry, I really didn't want you to get hurt. I don't know what know that doing I didn't know that doing this would put you so at risk. Sorry. Why make it so complicated? Just go for him. <laughs> eh, human, what did you say? No, you aren't you talking? Failed simple, why restrain your desires? This is not your original plan. Stop looking like I'm talking to you through the library speakers. I can clearly remember that you were not like this at first. It's the strange doctor. After you peeked at my report that time, you knew that the existence of this troublesome subject. Human eye. You started to go to the warehouse frequently and even lived there for a time. After you confirmed that there was no possibility to opening the door, you started pointing posting tips and guidance everywhere in the institution. In this way, after waking up, once you, once one can follow your help step by step and reach the library, then set up and in, set into, step into your trap. I really, in addition, these two, those, to those notes, you also bought the dragon. You even deliberately separated dangerous places off with traffic cones. Really? A caring grandma wolf pearl. Hidden danger don't didn't did you know how long this wolf has was lurking the library in the library halls, waiting to ambush? He knew that if he stayed in the warehouse he would probably be caught by me. So he lurked on the way to the library. He really waited a long, long time. I think that's incredible. I really admire his patience. I do not deny. It's a pity he still can't wait, couldn't wait. He gave up the long way and returned to the library. Until today, you woke, really woke up. You real and really reached your destination with his help. But now I... Isn't this the moment you have been waiting for? This living human being is standing right in front of you. 
white and tender, so healthy and within reach, not to mention a strong but still flexible body. Although I d it doesn't show much expression, I have seen it in your face and his butt. I know you stared <laughs> at it for a long time. What a perfect assimilation subject. I don't think that. I didn't think that. Whenever you want, you can proceed on him and assimilate him now. After the assimilation is complete, you will have enough strength to leave this institution. Troubles in hidden danger. Do you remember what he said before? I originally wanted to rely on that method. After assimilating with a human, the latex piece will greatly improve it in its ability. He wants to increase his strength and leave the institution. And, <clears throat> and this is his ultimate goal. Failed sample. I've completely disclosed the facts and you concealed. There is no need to pretend anymore. Just do it. Human. What he said is indeed true. I won't lie to you. Never heard again. In the beginning, I did plan out like that. I was waiting for you to lurk on the way only when I assimilated you with you and proved myself. Can I have a chance to leave this institution? I wanted to leave this place and go to the outside world and see for myself the sight of the world depicted on in the book. For this, I must make a change. I couldn't stay at the warehouse. The strange doctor goes often the, to the warehouse for inspection. I couldn't stay in the office either. I'm out. I'm an outlying lone wolf, and the other wolves no longer welcome me. Although the dragons in the computer room don't hate me, I can't live in their territory. In the end, I planned everything and decided to wait and ambush on the way to the library. You know how much effort I put into the change? You should have seen it all along the way. But as he said, I gave up. I returned to the library and I did not wait any longer. I waited too long, way too long. So long that I couldn't tell how long. No companions, no friends, no peers, no people to communicate with, lonely. Every day, staring at a door that no one will push open, waiting for the person who would never come. Faced with such a huge and boundless loneliness, I was afraid, and my mindset gradually began to change. I changed. I found that I, what I really wanted to escape from was not this institution, but loneliness. The thing that haunts me all the time, who tortures me day and night, loneliness. As opposed to a strong body, I, body, I need a partner who I can communicate with me. Even if I really become stronger, I still can't change my lonely s situation on who's, on what's so what's the use? Even if I really left the institution, but still remained all alone, what is the point? Even if I see the world and dre I dreamed of with nobody, but no now buddy to share my joy with, what should I do? I want to accompany. This is my true goal potential. My true ultimate goal. It's something I found after out after thinking about it. I I want to make friends with you, and, which is why I want to get your trust. I gave up the idea of assimilating you with assimilating with you early. If I really wanted to, I obviously would have had my opportunities, many opportunities. But I did nothing. I'm really just too lonely, just. I'm done, human. Stop being delusional.
How can humans and monsters be friends? Predator and prey be friends? Be realistic. You just need to knock him down now, and you will no longer, and you will be together forever. You. Will you believe me, human? Believe me, the monster? Wait, hand. Which one? Yes? Sure, really. I'm so naive. How could I human? Oh, okay, that was the correct one. Have you just said yes? Spin, 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 spin. Thank you, humans. Grunt. Okay, this is what I expected. Sure enough, you still could not do it. You just caused me to... Me, mere, me more work again. I knew that a failed subject was unreliable. You and your species are all failures anyways. It looks like a new latex piece has been added to the list of those that need to be dealt with. A troublesome hidden danger and a grunting wolf. Really interesting combination. I really look forward to what will happen to you later. You two can just stay there and keep flirting. I should go make the next preparations. Really disappointing. Really disappointed. Thank you. Thank you for believing me, human. I I will not betray you, your trust. Trust, this is the first step as a partner. I will strive to be an excellent latex piece. I will I'll try to help you get out of here. As long as I'm here, all the latex beasts won't want to bully you. I will impress you with my potential actions, human. Grunt. Thank you for your affirmation, I'm so happy. Oh, yes. Back to business, about leaving the library. Since there's nowhere to go from over there. Try another way. The other way is... That's a maintenance tunnel in that room over there. I'm sure that passage will take you out of here. This time you can absolutely believe me. It's just that there are some latex beasts in that room. It's a few sleepy latex beasts. Should be fine, right? Human beings are excellent as long as they are careful. There must be no problem. Do you want to see it, human? Is there a problem, human? Thank you, Puro. Ah, uh, what? No, you're welcome. Unbelievable, human. Thanking the monster, really? Thank you, too, human. I am so happy. Is that your tail? Oh, you're just gonna look at me the entire time? Room to the left is symmetrical to the one on the right. The maintenance SS entrance of the left is also available in the corresponding of the right room. This the entrance on the right is hidden by me. Can you find it, human? Yeah, one second, I wanna go save. That is it for this episode. I'm a little bit over time because I had to go through all that dialogue. See you in the next episode.